Transocean is undoubtedly the, the leader of the offshore drilling industry. It's gone through some challenging times, particularly as a result of uh, the Macondo disaster. Um, but I, I tend to focus um, for the future, so I look forward and, and I see a, a great potential associated to Transocean and, and where it's heading. Um, I also have experienced tremendous momentum at the management level, um, great alignment in terms of how to take the company and, and how to uh, take it forward and, and strengthen its current position. There are exciting opportunities around the world. There are emerging petroleum provinces in, in places like East Africa. There are new pre-salt provinces in places like Angola. There are new uh, opportunities for exploration in harsh environment and remote areas. And I think the company's capability to tackle those kinds of challenges creates really interesting and, and exciting growth opportunities in the future. And we've always been about improving that technological edge. And that's why our customers have historically come to us when they want to do something that's just a little bit harder and a little bit more difficult. The world is going to continue to need energy. Most of that energy is going to come from hydrocarbons. And the most attractive place to explore for significant accumulations of hydrocarbons is offshore. Our customers are going deeper and deeper, more and more remote environments, and harsher and harsher areas of the world. And Transocean's experience and expertise in helping our customers explore and, and develop hydrocarbons in those types of environments creates exciting opportunities for us going forward. Mm -hmm.